Hi guys, this is lesson two of pivot charts. So in lesson one, we created an access, a pivot chart, a pivot bar chart of salaries by state. And we also filtered to only see females. Okay, so here, now as promised, we're going to create a pie chart you with the same data so let's start from scratch again we do not want to save this okay so again this is our table we click on the table go to create pivot chart click here we get our field list our field list is all the are all the fields or the column headers in our table okay so here we're going to first go to change chart type I'm going to change the chart type and we have access to all these cool charts and for different char uh, data there's different appropriate charts for our data bar chart was helpful column charts helpful and also pivot chart might be a good one so let's just select the basic pivot chart close this and let's go ahead and take our and uh, populate our pivot chart so you see it's slightly different than the bar chart okay because pivot uh, charts, I mean uh, pie charts, have one less dimension of information they can show. Okay, you'll see what I mean. So we'll take salary for sure, grab it, drag it into the data area, let go, and we get one big blue pie, which doesn't really serve our purposes yet, but this will quickly change. Once we grab the state, and we drop the state into this, on the right side here, category field and you see instantly it broke it up into the three slices each slice is a different state and it has not labeled them for us we'll have to go ahead and do that but if we hover over them we see that this green one is Texas the blue one is Connecticut and the red one is New York okay now we can also add the dimension of gender we can grab gender and drop it into the filter area the pivot chart does not change the pie chart does not change at all until we decide hey we don't want to see males and females we only want to see males so if you remember the and if you don't remember it, all you have to know is that the, the female field is true when it's a female and false when it's a male okay so by selecting checking only false I'm only looking at males and you see the, sli the, the green slice got slightly bigger, red slice got slightly smaller, so there was a little bit of uh, change in the, in the pie chart. Actually, it looks really symmetrical now, and that was totally unintentional. Okay, so now let's go and see if we can figure out how to get labels on our chart. Okay, so let's click on Properties, and let's see if we can figure out how to get a title up here we can also get a legend and that should do it so in our title we'll click on it and go to format we can change the title name to uh, customer salaries salary by state that's an appropriate name and our pivot chart is, uh, legend is over here we can further uh, make some uh, formatting changes make everything look nicer get the colors that we like but the point here was to just create this pie chart using the pivot chart function in access okay so that is what we intended to do Here's our legend. It is a little bit far off to the right, but the pivot chart and pivot table in Access is a more dynamic tool for visualizing the data in a concise and uh, real summary kind of way where we can make decisions, business decisions, and whatever uh, decisions we need to make. It's not really for producing fantastic graphics and making uh, nice printed documents but we do nevertheless we do have a legend over here on the right which helps us to see that this is Connecticut this is New York and this 
is Texas. Okay, so I hope this was a good uh, introduction to pivot charts and uh, make sure that if you missed lesson one on this that you go back and you watch that because there we build it up a little bit slower and we go through the process a little slower and in more detail. In lesson two we just we went ahead, we jumped in, and we created this chart. All in all, I think it's a great tool, along with pivot tables especially, to learn about. Uh, besides that, make sure to watch all the other Access tutorials, subscribe to the channel, watch the Excel tutorials, and till next time, have a great day.